So now if you want to change the collet out, we have different options for different, different types of parts we're going to be holding. When you pull it this way, it'll grab tight on the part. When you push it this way, it'll release the part. You can see it slides nicely. When I pull it tight, holds it in there nice and tight. So I'm going to tape this out. And the way we do that is you can, you can spin this, kind of hold on to this, make sure the machine is off until you see this thing. Push that button, push it in, and it'll release the collar. So we're going to run the collar all the way out until it's completely disengaged then push it in and it'll pop the collet out now we can take this right off now when you put this back in you want to wipe down the surface make sure that there's no chips on it make sure that the threads are clean and this has a little keyway in it that engages with a key that's inside of here you want to take the towel again wipe everything down inside make sure that there are no chips when you put that in slide it in so that it sits in the key and it won't be able to rotate. So now we're gonna push this all the way back in, and that'll pop the collet out and see how they move together. So I'm gonna hold the collet and turn the collar, and that will engage the threads. I'm gonna do it until it's a little bit tight, and then get a piece of my material and make sure that when it's loose, I can fit the part in. And when I pull it tight and it sticks, it holds my part nice and tight, and that's good. So now I'm going to move this to the nearest. Loosen it. Now I'm going to move this to the nearest spot where that lines up. You can see the collar where it lines up with one of those little keyways. And make sure that sits nice and flush and is in there nice and tight. And then I can take my part again and double check that it's right. So I can slide this in nice and loose, and then when I pull it, it's held nice and tight. 